And now it's time for Hobo Reviews with Willie Be a Hobo. Tonight's review, Romeo and Juliet, the 1968 edition. Oh my god, this is the best moment I've ever seen in my whole life! Thou hast taken me away with spoilers! Eat! There's this couple named Romeo and Juliet, who are not really a couple, but they happen to be best friends, who happen to be friends of families who are rivals of each other. So the two families are going back and forth, attacking each other. Oh, I don't like you. Well, I don't like you either. Well, fine then. Let's just agree to disagree. Who can't find by me? And that's where Romeo and Juliet meet up with each other. Then they decide to sneak off and meet up at a romantic ball. Or party of some sort of mama. Anyways, Romeo disguises himself in a costume that is very undetectable. So that that way he can sneak in and be with Juliet. Romeo, Romeo, where for all now, Romeo? And the two get a nice little relationship going. And they're going all smoochy, smoochy, smoochy. You know, like this. <laughs> so then Romeo and Juliet decide they should be married. Except that Juliet's father does not know about this. So he decides to have Juliet marry somebody else. But then Juliet's like, you know what? Let me fake my death so that, that way this can all blow by. And that Romeo and I can live happily ever after together. Except someone had to take this seriously and decided to tell Romeo that Juliet is dead. Even though Juliet's pretending to be dead. But Romeo, seeing as how he doesn't know because the friar did not beat the m m servant to the punch, Romeo then assumes that Juliet is dead. So he stabs himself in the... to death. I don't know where he stabbed himself, but he stabs himself and dies. With a poison and all that stuff. So then Juliet wakes up and discovers that Romeo is dead. No! Romeo! Oh, how can I live without Romeo? So what does she do? She stabs herself in the abdomen until she can join Romeo. In heaven. And then the two are buried. The families decide to let bygones be bygones. And they become, well, unionized together. And so that's pretty much it. It's a depressing ending. Although, you know what What could have made this a happier ending? If you expanded the movie so that Romeo and Juliet can live happily ever after in heaven! I don't know why they don't show that to Mama! But other than that, I for one happen to like this movie because it's a classic Shakespeare classic that has romance, which is perfect for Valentine's Day. Except for the ending, that was very, very tragic and I think they could have expanded that by showing Romeo and Juliet in heaven. This is Willie B. Homo saying... Charge! You got charge! I'll come on up a guy, will you? Come on, change! Come on! I want to freaking be married to somebody else and that way I can live a wonderful life! <laughs>